guys and welcome back hey guys i'm really excited today as we not only get to test out and review the brand new majority rs1 microphone yep from the same company that brought us those super unique looking majority two bio earphones and they're ready to upload majority on headsets but you know what i get to announce at the end of this video that we will be giving one of these rs1 microphone kits away to one lucky winner yeah a member of the Go Get Yours fam. But first, before we get into that, let's check the microphone out. So the majority RS1 is an affordable condenser microphone that I think could be suitable for a gaming setup for live streaming with your buddies, or if you like me, for doing any type of voiceover segments. As we open it up, everything comes extremely well packaged and presented. We get a simple user manual, where you can get to know a few facts about the microphone. We are supplied with a 1.7 meter USB 3.0 to Type-C audio cable, that will indeed plug into the rear of the microphone. I'll simply show you guys in a minute. Yep, that cable is certainly lengthy enough to root wherever you might need it. And also within this same package, we get the three-legged compact mic stand, which is suitable for tabletops and flat surfaces. Ah, it looks like we've got no type of pop filter though. Hmm. Ah, then, now this might be a bit important when it comes to those plosive sounds from your voice when you're sitting pretty close up to the mic. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we might not need one. But hey, let's take a closer look at the mic itself. Now, this microphone has a sampling rate of 16 bits 48 kilohertz. It features a cardioid pickup pattern, which means that you should be speaking and recording directly into the front of the capsule with that Type-C power port facing to the back. Nope, nope, there's no volume, monitor or mute buttons upon the microphone. And rather than it sitting within a shock mount, well, this microphone sits within a U-shaped positionable mounting bracket. Let's quickly get it set up by simply screwing in the RS1 into the little tripod. By the way, just a quick note guys, you can go ahead and unscrew that attached threaded adapter and you will then be able to use this microphone capsule direct onto an aftermarket scissor stand should you wish. Now I think we've got to be a bit gentle when extending out the legs on that tripod stand. You know, honestly they don't feel too sturdy when pulling them out. When they are fully extended though, well the microphone does sit really solid considering that the microphone capsule itself does weigh 230 grams. Lastly, we can now plug in that Type-C end of that audio cable into the back of the microphone and route that wire to wherever you may need it. Connecting it direct to our laptop today, making sure though that even though it does have auto setup, that the microphone settings are set to our preferred device within the Windows setup. So yes, now it's all set up, let's go ahead and test it out. Alright guys, so the RS1 microphone just now, we are sat around about 6 to 12 inches away. It is the preferred distance to sit, and all the ambient noises are running in the background, such as this laptop and the TV being on in the background too. Basically, it's just to show you guys how well the microphone performs at blocking out those background noises. Hello, hello, hello guys! Testing, testing! P, P, P! T, T, T! Yeah! Yeah, I know, some simple test, right? But let's take a listen to the background static and take a close listen to that sound floor. Hmm, not too shabby. But the question is, can you sing or rap with this microphone? Well, <clears throat> let's put it to the test, shall we? Mmm, toast it. Just the way I like it. Bring me the bass all the way to your face. Swinging it raw, swinging it right. Bringing it down to the end of the night Saying, who be the best to be the best Though you can't see who guess what I'm saying Yeah, you say, yo, I'm saying, no But back to the front, to the back window Front window, back window, sing, yes Big up, big up, big up, your fucking chest What the fucking hack in the back We're going to smack and trap from she What the fucking hole, what the fucking hole What the fucking hey, what the fucking this What the fucking that, fucking way Back in the back and smack in the track and shit What the fucking hit What the You be the best, if you be the best, though you can't listen to me, guess what, I'm saying yes, you sing yo, I'm saying no, with the back to the front of the back window, but window, back window, sing yes, big up, big up, big up, you fucking chest, whoop, 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 thank you, thank you, 
then we have now plugged in the RS Swan into the PS5 console and it was really swift to set up. Now we've had the opportunity to listen to a few videos back already and in regards to that audio to be really truthful we actually thought that the microphone pickup overall was real good. But tell me what you guys think in the comment section down below. Me I certainly don't think that those plosive letters PP TT resulted in any type of extreme or noticeable distortion but what do you think i do think it's worthy to stream with and the audio sounds nice crisp and clear considering that price tag now we did think that it was real fast to set this desktop microphone up right out of the box but one thing we have got to note right from the off is that you have to bear in mind what surface you're placing this microphone upon as most likely it's suitable to be placed upon the elevated area upon your desk just so it's close enough just above your chest height in order for you to experience the best preferred audio pickup. Yep, you can go ahead and add an aftermarket foam filter should you wish, just for added protection against voice distortion. But other than that, just make sure that the microphone levels are set to your desired suitable level for what you'll be using this microphone for. Now, it's that time, the giveaway. First of all, I want to thank everyone for the past couple of years for all you guys that are still stuck around. I really do appreciate it. But if you want to try and get your hands on one of these mic kits, well, here is how to enter. First, you need to like this video and subscribe to the channel just now. I will be thoroughly checking all the requirements out carefully, so please make sure to subscribe or we may need to do a re-roll of the giveaway in order to find a winner. Next, if you go over to Instagram, go over to the majority Instagram page. Here it is just here and give them a follow. Not only that, give our Go Get Yours review page a follow too. And yeah, it's as simple as that. I will in fact be choosing a winner in the next two weeks. So you will have up to two weeks to get your entries in. So be fast about it. Again, I will be checking all the requirements out. And I have to note, certain crunches may be void from this giveaway based upon what's happening within certain countries in the world just now. Not only that, based upon the current strike action that's happening with postal services here within the UK, there might be a few limitations at the moment, but I will in fact endeavour to send out the item as soon as the lucky winner is chosen. Now all of the giveaway requirements are listed within the video description down below. Please, please follow these rules carefully, and if you are in fact lucky enough to be chosen, then it will only be me contacting you. So if anyone gets any type of emails, asking for a postage payment, I don't ask for no postage, and if you do get any of those emails, they will in fact be fake. Anyway guys, I want to thank you all for watching this video today. You can check this microphone out for yourself. I have left a handy little link in the video description down below for you guys to take a look. If you have liked what you've seen within this video, you can go get yours. But yes, I hope to see you guys on our very next video coming very soon. Stay tuned and peace! Yeah.